Hold on. This is Prince. He's a, an MTV casting director, so let's see if I got the job. Hello? Hey, man. What's up? Prince Hi, here. Hi, Prince. How's it going? Ow! Alright, guys. Third time's a charm. I try to get this thing focused. Good morning, everyone! How's it going, guys? My name is Amanda Riley, if you don't already know. You guys, I got some really exciting news. I'm really excited to share this with you guys. Not really news, but I'm just really, like, high on life right now. This is so awesome. I really just want to share a lot of my life with you guys. That's why I do these vlogs, is because one day I kind of, like, looked at my Instagram, and I thought, like, it's just so bland and not really in-depth, and I love being in front of the camera, and I really want to share my life with you guys, whether it's traveling somewhere or doing a fun job or trying to be inspirational and having something to say and you know getting my mind and my opinion out there so I feel like vlogging is a good way for me to do that. I watched this documentary called What the Health. I made my mom and my dad watch it and tonight I'm gonna make my best friend Mikey watch it. How I took it in was about it's kind of mostly about America and how America's meat and dairy and animal products are processed and so this documentary was really cool because um, when I was a senior in high school I went vegan in 2011. I started eating fish and eggs about two or three years ago. I really love it and I love how my insides feel and I love how, you know, my asthma's gone away. It's really changed my life and I've really noticed how I perform better, I think clearer, I work out better, I have my sleeps better, and this movie kind of just like brought back a lot of stuff that I did when I did this research project in high school. It's like a year and a half research project. My project was about um, heart disease, how diet can really change and reverse a lot of heart disease and high cholesterol and diabetes. My dad has had high cholesterol and high blood pressure and it's really cool to see how diet can really change that. So my sister and I agreed the next two weeks we're gonna make my dad go plant-based after watching this documentary and try and get my dad off his medications. He's on like six different medications right now. So, uh, we're really hoping that we can really get him to stick to this, make a difference in his health. I uh, wanted to share that with you guys. I don't want to sound too preachy on it. I don't want to sound like you have to go vegan, but um, I do care about the environment and I do care about animals and I care about my friends and family and you guys and I'm a strong advocate for being healthy. And another really cool part of this documentary is this doctor that said like, there's this whole trend going on right now about you know loving your body which is so great and so empowering um, but there's a difference between loving your body and being confident and being healthy versus loving your body being confident and having the risk of diabetes or you know having high cholesterol and high blood pressure you know there's just two different sides to that. Not saying either one is right or wrong, but it's really to like take a step back and look at, okay, if we're promoting like love your body and be comfortable in your skin, then that should be love your body and take care of your body, you know? Eat clean and eat good. Work out because you love your body, not because you hate your body. Diet to me is really important because um, I want to be around for my grandbabies and I want to be running around when I'm 75 years old and have lots of energy and I want my dad to do the same. I want my dad and my mom to be around when I have kids. Family is really important to me, so it's really important for me to talk about health and diet and exercise and stuff like that. So Sunday night I kind of convinced my parents to watch it and they know I've been vegan forever. They watched it knowing kind of like with a um like a bad taste in their mouth a little bit about it and I think this will really change their mind when my dad starts to you know eat differently wean off his meds like that's the goal is to get my dad to wean off his meds and then tonight my best friend Mikey and I are gonna watch it I kind of convinced him to watch it too he eats a lot of meat too so if I can get my best friend and my parents to eat, um, be more conscious of it and go plant-based that'd be so awesome so I really hope Mikey gets as much out of this documentary as I do as I did and yeah one step at a time, guys. Let's make a difference. Hold on. This is Prince. He's a, an MTV casting director, so let's see if I got the job. Hello? Hey, man. What's up? Prince Hi. here. Hi, Prince. How's it going? How are you? Thanks so much for that video. It was really good. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you liked it. <laughs> yeah, it was really good. You did the energy. It was perfect. Just like... All right, guys. We're back. Uh, sorry. So, Danny just called me. Really excited. Um, our video comes out in 10 days, you guys. And we're just going over some final... Uh, logistics and stuff like that. We're having a release party on the 31st. I'm really excited. Big stuff is coming up. Uh, okay guys, oh this is a really exciting part. So I'm just gonna go on a quick lunch break. Um, my best friend growing up, her name's Taylor Hymas. She had a baby almost a year ago. And I've been traveling and I've been living in New York so I haven't been able to meet her. Finally get to meet her so come check her out because I've never seen her before but she's literally just in photos and videos you guys. The cutest baby. I've ever seen and I'm so happy for Taylor because she is like the greatest mom ever. You wanna see her? She's so fucking cute. Okay guys, she's here. Yes. Taylor's about to like laugh because <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. 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 Hi pretty 
Oh my god, she's looking at me like, what the freak? Blake, say hello. Oh my god, Blake. Hi. Oh my god, Taylor. Oh. Say hi, babe. She's sassy. Look at this hot mom, you guys. Look at this, like, she had a baby less than a year ago. Guys, 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 guys. Oh, Blake, stop making those adorable little noises. Look at this mom in her natural habitat. Oh my God, is she wearing denim? Look at oh, that yeah. face. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi. You ready? Wow, you're so beautiful. Say cheese. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. This is a cute little restaurant we're at today. It's called Yellow Vase. Very cute, right? Oh my god, you guys, look at this beast. Patrick Skogans in his not short habitat. Coming through the door like BAM! Oh my god. <laughs> Hi, Pat. What's going on, people, Amanda's followers? Guys, it's Pat's yeah. first time eating this baby, too. I'm just being annoying over here. <laughs> Back up. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do, Pat. <laughs> there we are! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys, we're nice. here. I'm at Listen, shut up, stop. Shoot the video. So we're here at my best friend Mikey's house. Mikey and I have been friends for a very long time since like middle school or high school. Mikey is a meathead. Eats probably a hundred, oh my God, look at his dog. Hi, Dre. <laughs> uh, Mikey eats about a hundred grams of protein a day, like just like an obscene amount of protein. So we're gonna watch what the health, I'm gonna see what his before and after. <sighs> I don't know if it's gonna change a thing. You don't think it's gonna change a thing? No. What did your two friends from Elite say? I they went vegan after it. You don't think you'll ever be vegan? No. What about plant-based? No. No? No. Okay. How are we gonna watch this, by the way? Two hours later. All right, guys, we're here at Mikey's house. We watched What the Health. Mike, what do you think of it? I think I'm a vegan now. You guys, we ordered Veggie Grill for dinner. Can you believe it? <laughs> I just... <laughs> All the credit for this, guys. I made yeah. Mikey new vegan. He even wanted veggie grill. He was like, "Yeah, we should, we should get veggie grill." It's pretty good. Chilling.